This is Sequoia TV. Don't miss Henry's Garden, Saturday mornings on Sequoia TV. Hi, I'm Henry Tenenbaum. Welcome to this special edition of Henry's Garden for Sequoia TV. We're here at Sequoia Hospital where we're going to demonstrate hospital gardening. Now, this is a very fine art and one that's been developed over the many years that hospitals have been in existence. The first thing you want to do with hospital gardening is to be sure to find a suitable vessel. Something that's been well used like this, for example, excellent drainage. You can see it's perfectly uh, commodious for these purposes. And what you're going to do is fill this up with a little bit of soil. You want to get some nice soil there on the bottom. Um, sometimes you might want to use like vinyl sort of hospital gloves to do this to keep your hands nice and sterile. Um, I always am sure to ster uh, sterilize my hands just before uh, I do my own gardening because you don't want to let any of those uh, nasty germs get in the way. You know, nosocomial viruses in the, uh, in the garden are really dangerous. Then you're going to take a plant at it. So you pop this baby in here like so and pop another one in here like so. Um, hospital gardening is rewarding because, as I have found, it, you end up making the plants feel so much better at the end. Uh, put in the soil like so. Um, now, you, you probably want to like, if you're going to add any more, you want to be putting like a little hole in the soil here to add another plant. And to do that, you can use your finger or uh, tongue depressors make excellent ways of digging up new areas in the soil. And then, of course, uh, add water. And one of the keys to hospital gardening is that you always want to be sure that you've got implements that are consistent with the environment of the hospital. And add water like so, a little soil like this. And then what you could also do is to mulch by using hospital bandages because uh, hospital bandages makes an excellent... Oh, you're kidding. What? No. Oh, you're... Oh, 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 that kind of hospital... Why didn't you guys tell? I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. <laughs> okay, so I got I got that uh, like hospital gardening thing just a little wrong. Uh, to get a real sense of what hospital gardening really is, we've come here to Sequoia Hospital in Redwood City, where they have beautiful landscapes, just gorgeous gardening. These are the people in charge, Connie and Phil, hard at work, slaving away. What are you doing here? Well, uh, I'm picking off the dead flowers. I was told years ago that uh, when they rot on the ground or rot on the plant, they uh, cause a fungus to spread to the uh, healthier flowers. Right. It's also bad for the image of the hospital having yeah. this rot. So you don't call it, though, you don't call it like deadheading here. You, you call it like seriously injured heading, right? <laughs> Would that be correct? Yeah, I never call it deadheading. Yeah, please, please just remember that. <laughs> 